Good morning, YouTube. It's been a while since I've done a video. So right now, me and Mrs. Backwoods are on our way to do something. You're going to find out. So I'm here with Kendall. We're at Serpentini in Westlake, Ohio. And he just got me this new ride. We're going to be getting rid of the other Ford. So we got a new truck. We're going to be decking it out. Kendall's bent over backwards trying to help me out here. Great salesman. He's helped me the whole way through. So this was like a three-day process going through everything. Yeah, exactly. Matt came in. He told me exactly what he was trying to do. So with the help of my managers and the good team I have here at Serpentini Westlake, we were able to make it happen. I mean, look at this thing. You got chrome all on the front, chrome on the wheels. You got the big bed cover in the back. Pretty much everything you need. So. This will be the subject of a lot of videos to come, I'm sure. <laughs> yep, yep. We got some we got some big plans for it. So you're gonna have to stay tuned to see more of what's gonna be happening with this truck. But we're gonna be building it out a little bit in the back. Wanted to get a new truck. Um, got the old one still right there. Um, I'm gonna be selling that one. Um, this one is older. It is, this is a 2019, this is a 2021, but this one actually has less miles on it. It has the longer bed. Um, it's pretty much the same on the inside. There's some other little features that I will show you. And it's got, the toolbox on the side which i'm going to explain to you what we're going to be doing with that now this does lock um i unlocked it before we did this i'm going to open it up so somebody already had it built out but this is my idea i'm going to use this and i'm going to make the inside of this i don't know i might change some of this up a little bit i'm going to turn this into like the mobile fishing mobile Okay, so this is gonna be in here. It's gonna be like a tackle box. I'm gonna have like all my accessory stuff in there. So I don't have to drag stuff out of the truck every single time. It's gonna be ready to ready to go. So, and it is on both sides. I don't know if the other side's unlocked. Let's take a look. I might have unlocked it, but yep. But yeah, I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna put other tackle in here, get everything really nice and organized. That way, I'm never without what I actually need. Now, in the back of the truck, back here, you can see I actually have some stuff. Um, my sister-in-law had to do some carpet cleaning last night, so I had that in there. Got my toolbox. I'm going to be taking this stuff out. I'll kind of show you in there. This is the longer bed, so I will be able to fit my fishing rods in there. Now, J.B. Conway, back at uh, Shoot Dang Fest, it was like two years ago, um, she gave me this tent and while the tent won't work in here i thought this might be kind of neat if there's inclement weather you know it's ohio we got jacked up weather but i thought this would be kind of neat because what i can do is i can set the cotton here and i could camp in the back of this and i'm going to set it up um, the windows do open for the truck and the back of this uh this cover so uh, yeah so i'm really excited we're going to be building this out making it pretty neat that way i can still get my fishing rods in there but have something in there for me so if i wanted to lay down do anything like that i am able to so really excited this is kind of a game changer for me like i said i'm going to be selling the other one back there i'm not keeping both of them there's no sense i don't don't need to uh, but this is just financially this was a better decision for me to make going to be saving a little bit of money because it's it's older but it has less miles and it's actually in just a nice shape and this thing it like i said it pretty much has everything that i had before but this is uh this is cool and we're going to be doing some stuff to it it's got a ladder rack on top too which is nice Get the, oh i guess i'm not going to lock it up i got to bring stuff in later anyways but i'll show you the inside of the truck here and i'm really excited about this 
So here's the inside. Ignore it. I got a bag from a store in there, and I got it specifically covering up some paperwork in there. But here's the back seat. Pretty big. A lot of room. Got a little fold-out cup holder there. Got the cigarette lighter. Got two USB chargers back here. Um, it's power. It's really clean. It's nice. And like I said, this is actually the bigger version of my truck. So um, this is the XLT. My other one is the SXT. Um, and then here's the, the front in here. And this is one of my new favorite features of this truck. Okay, I'm going to explain to you. And I've been saying this to anybody that's gotten in this truck. Okay, I say, do you want a warm tushy? Because we have a warm tushy button now, which is amazing. I'm sure that's going to help out. It might make things smell weird too. I don't know. But um, yeah, and then this actually seats. I'm not going to pull the whole thing. Well, I guess I could. I'll show you guys that too. Okay, so the center does go up. It actually seats three in the front and three in the back. They're plane going over. And then you got storage down here. And this cup holder can actually pop out and flip around. So that's kind of cool. I got two USB charging ports up in the front. Um, it rides great. It's got brand new tires. That one doesn't. There's so many pluses to this one. It isn't even funny, but I'm really excited. There's going to be a lot of projects going ready to get this as the mobile fishing mobile. But these sides are going to be all decked out with all my fishing stuff. So I'm not going to have to pack up and go my stuff's going to be in the truck and it's going to be boom 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 getting it done now as you can see the trees this is kind of odd they really aren't budding yet usually i feel like beginning of april we have some now the flowering tree across the street is budding but uh these trees i don't uh, i guess i see a little bit on it but i feel like usually we're a little bit farther into it further Further, not farther, further into it than we are now. But, um, you know, there's still dead leaves on the tree across the street. I got to get this front yard cleaned up. You know, we had the work done over there. I got to fix that. The company that did it did a horrible job doing that. Um, but I'm going to have to get these trimmed up a little bit. I think these are actually going to be coming out. I don't know. I'm out here. I'm just telling you guys. But yeah, I'm really excited. Got a lot of good things going on. A lot of big things. This was a big purchase for me. We're going to be saying goodbye to that guy. We're going to get him um, to his new home. And we're going to get this built out. Um, I'm going to be doing that over this weekend so that I can move forward, start doing uh, more fishing videos, more outdoors videos, gonna do some truck camping, all sorts of stuff. I got all sorts of ideas. This, I think, was a good investment for me and I'm really excited. So I hope you guys stay tuned. So um, glad that I got to show you guys that. I was hoping to have that come out sooner. Uh, Paisley is currently climbing up in my lap because this is where she lives at night you can see her she's right there say hi paisley say hi oh i know <laughs> anyways well she's loving on me now so i'm gonna get going and atlas is over here getting jealous oh big face but anyways stay tuned you guys are gonna see some big things happening with the truck we're gonna build out those tackle boxes i'm not gonna have to get things ready to go fishing anymore this is really exciting for me so stay tuned we'll see you on the next one we'll have another one coming out soon oh my light just died i guess it's telling me to leave bye everybody slime on love ya